Thursday. It is currently 8 a.m. and I have a day off. So I thought I would just show you guys what I normally do on my days off and I have a lot to do today so I thought I would just take you guys around but of course I gotta start the day off with putting on some makeup I've already primed and moisturized my face I use the Shea Moisture um, can you see that? <laughs> Shea Moisture Daily Glow Priming Moisturizer so it's a moisturizer and um, primer in one I take the Catrice Prime and Fine um, spray. This is kind of just another primer to really keep my makeup in place. Take this like mouse pad to fan myself out. Since I am doing a lot today, I'm gonna go for a medium coverage foundation and I'm gonna use the Joa Truly Yours Natural Finish Foundation Drop. Um, this is actually so good and I believe it's really affordable it's from CVS and it's a new brand and it's really really good oh my god Sean Mendes sorry if I'm like a little quiet I literally woke up an hour ago for concealer I'm taking the Catrice camouflage high coverage concealer this is one of my favorites it's very very affordable Honestly, this sponge is so stiff. It's gonna get me a while to get used to. I mean, it really does like blend nicely. And I like how the foundation and the concealer doesn't like soak up in the sponge. But um, it's kind of like hard. And then I'm gonna take the Milk Makeup Blur and Set um, Powder. Can you even see that? This light is just... I don't really set my whole face with this just because I really love this powder and I want to save every bit of it. Um, so I just like to mainly focus it on my T-zone or like the places I get oily and my under eyes. And then I set the rest of my face with the Cody Airspun powder. And for my eyes, I'm just gonna go and take the bronzing powder again, just as my transition shade. And just put that all over my lid, really. I'm using the Pretty Vulgar um, Nightingale palette. And I'm just gonna use Hide and Seek. And the shade right here, Flip Out. Just like mix those two and just blend it all over my eyes. And I like to take just flip out and just focus on the outer edge of my eye just to darken and deepen it out a bit. I'm gonna take this like bronzy brown shade in Clutch and just put that all over my lid. This is like a shimmery shade. It's really, really pretty. And I really love this palette, you guys. I think I got it from a BoxyCharm box. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I got it from a BoxyCharm box. And I was really impressed with the formula. I've never tried anything from Pretty Vulgar. And I just really love, like, the metallic shades in this and just how the matte shades blend. It's really, really good. I'm just going to go ahead and throw some mascara. I'm taking the It Cosmetics Superhero Mascara. So, yeah. I'm like literally getting so congested. For my lips, I'm gonna take the Fresh Sugar Lip Caramel Lip Balm. This is like one of my favorite everyday lip balms. To set my face, I'm taking the Kula Makeup Setting Spray. And this has just SPF uh, 30 in it. And Kula actually sent this to me, so thank you so much because this is amazing. This has a matte finish and it just has a really nice spritz to it too. So it's really, really good and it protects your face from the sun, so. Since this look is kind of lacking color, I'm going to put a red lip. This is the NARS um, Velvet Matte Lip Pencil in Cruella. Such a really nice, pretty red. I'm just gonna take it on this uh, brush from Luxie. This is the mini flat angled brush. 
I just find that applying it with a brush really gives a really nice, um, I don't even know what I'm talking about. So I'm just gonna put that on my lip. Like, it just looks really natural on the lips, I would say. And then I'm gonna go and brush my hair. I don't really do much to my hair just because it's really, really dead. Um, so I kind of just brush the edges, leave it be. So that is the finished uh, makeup look. I literally spent 25 minutes on this natural looking makeup look. So I'm not even sure if I'm going to include the whole entire thing. Okay, so now I'm going to go and take you guys through my day. Hopefully the weather is good outside because I heard it was going to snow today. And I'm just like not, I'm not down for that. Come on, buddy. Gotta go. You gotta go. Don't get all comfortable. Come on. Get up. Get up, boy. So this is my outfit. Jacket is from Garage. Sweater is from Forever 21. Jeans are Calvin Klein. And shoes are from TJ Maxx. And, um... Yeah, I look really, really cozy, but I'm pretty sure it's still not enough for this cold air. Okay, I just realized that it's only 9.30 and none of the stores that I wanted to go to like open until 11. So I think I'm just gonna sit around, make myself some coffee, charge my phone, and then I'm gonna head out. But right now I'm just gonna take off my jacket and just like chill for a bit because I have like two hours to spare. Okay, you guys. I literally took a nap for that two hours, um, so my eyes look kind of down. It's literally because I just woke up from my nap, and it is brick outside. It is 30 freaking degrees. Why? First stop is Target. Don't know what I'm necessarily getting, but um, we're going to look for something there. And then I'm gonna go to Marshall's because it's in that little um, little center that they have. So I thought it would just be perfect and then that way I could also get my Starbucks. And then I'm gonna go to Five Below because I wanna get a car, um, car mount for my phone. Now hopefully I find my dad's gift by then because I do have to pick up my brother. And then I'm gonna probably go thrifting after I pick him up and drop him off home. But other than that, let's just head out to Target. <laughs> so I just came back from Five Below. As you can see, I bought the car mount um, because my phone is in a different location and I'm so excited. It took me like 20 minutes to set this up. And now I'm gonna go to Target. I figured I went to Five Below first because Target's on the way back and so is Marshall's. So, just got the car mount, and I'm so excited because now I can film like this in my car. Okay guys, so not much luck at Target at all. I actually only got like four things. And I got my Starbucks. Yeah, if you guys couldn't tell, that was my car mount. Um, whoa. This is the tall white chocolate um, mocha latte. It's pretty freaking good. Like, not bad at all. My hair is a mess because it's windy. It's cold, but um, Marshall's is right there. So we're gonna go ahead there now, get my dad's gift, and then maybe go thrifting until I have to pick up my brother. Yeah. We made it to Marshall's. I am praying I actually find some stuff here because I haven't had any luck. Here, get all these holiday stuff. Once again, no luck. And I'm kind of disappointed because I just can't find anything. Um, so right now, all I have for my dad is a sweater and 
don't know. I just feel really bummed out because I couldn't get whatever I thought I was gonna get him. I was gonna get him shoes, but none of the shoes really fit his style. Ugh, I don't know. It's just not a productive day today. Plus, it got really gloomy real quick. And it's just not cute outside. I just want to go home, but I also want to go thrifting. So, um, you know what? That's my last chance. If I end up finding something for him while I'm thrifting, then... Hey guys, so let me update y'all on what I got at the thrift store. First of all, I got nothing for my dad, which uh, really just sucks because the whole point of me going out was to buy him a present in the first place, and I couldn't find anything. So I went to the thrift store. I got some stuff, but overall, it really wasn't a good thrift day. Um, I'll probably go inside and show you guys what I got. You know what, I'll just show you guys what I got right now. Since I'm in the car, let's start with Five Below. I got this pajama. This pajama for my dog. It's so, so cute, and I really want a pajama set for him. And this was the only one they had. I don't really like the design. It's kind of cheesy. I don't think this is gonna keep him warm, but I really wanted to get him a pajama, so. I just got my dad like a happy birthday gift bag even though I literally only got him <laughs> the sweater. Oh, and I also got the, the mount, the heavy duty car mount that I have on my phone right now. And then from Target, I got some car air freshener. I feel like this is such a boring haul. Like I just got necessities. Got an Airwick um, freshener. This is like their fragrance, just a refill. This is the Tropical Flowers fragrance, and I bought this for the house because we have one in the kitchen. And then I bought the Glade one. This is the Lavender and Peach Blossom fragrance uh, refill. This is for my bathroom. The main reason why I wanted to go to Target was to get um, earrings for my second piercing. So I just got these um, from Sugar Fix. And now for the fun part. This is the haul part for from the thrift store. First one I got was um, this knit uh, cardigan sweater thing. This is from the men's section. It's really, really cute. It's a cardigan, but it's like knitted. It's like a chunky knit cardigan. Then I got a red turtleneck, just a really basic piece, but I've been wanting a red turtleneck and I know I wasn't gonna pay like 20 bucks for one. And then I just got a chunky knit beanie is just a black one pretty cute I'm gonna wash all of these guys because I want to walk like I want to wear it already this one's probably like my favorite pickup because it's like a fuzzy plain yellow sweater oh this is just so comfortable I can't wait to like wash this and just lay with this because it's so soft and this was only three dollars guys and of course if you guys saw like the snippet um, of when I was like recording a few pieces in the thrift store. I ended up getting the the guest jacket just cause it's so cute. I was like, I don't know if I should get it, but then I tried it on and then I was like, mm, I'm gonna get it. And it also has a hood, which is so convenient because I love these jackets, but some of them don't come with hoods. And I just found like the perfect one. It's not a soft, but you could tell this is like a really vintage old guess. I mean, it literally says guess Los Angeles 1981. So guys, it is such a like, such a bummy day today. It's only 1.30 and I already feel so tired and just, I don't know, unproductive. I just wanna sleep. But you guys, I feel like this is the end of the vlog. It's 
pretty boring like this is what I did on my day off um, I mean I guess it makes sense I'm just gonna go and relax now have a cup of coffee and just take a nap but yeah I hope you guys enjoyed my vlog still I know it's so boring and like kind of unproductive because I didn't really find anything I wanted but I hope you guys still enjoyed it so yeah I hope you guys enjoy your day I will see you guys next time. Bye guys. Oh my god, it's so pretty outside though. I can't lie. So it's really a mess out here. Like we got two cars just stuck in the middle of the road. The lights aren't working. I almost died. Like tell me how I left the house at 2.30. And it's 3.31. And the whole time, I was just stuck in traffic. This right now is chaotic right now. Like, I, I, I couldn't even go to the school. Like, I knew I was going to be stuck for another 25 minutes. So, I'm literally over here. It's CVS. And I'm like, Rocky, you better walk over here. Because I'm, I cannot stand being in traffic for, like, another 20 minutes. Just trying to pick you up when you're right around the corner. <gasps> People are just like... Being annoying.